I just picked up the keys to the first 2022 Silverado that will have a all chrome 12 inch lift, 26 by 16 Forgiatos and 40s. First in the world. Let's get this bread. For you in the middle of the interstate? No, I have not. Floor. Somebody's being stupid up there. Cops won't let us turn around. It's a big problem. This is a problem. Like half asleep. And I gotta get up at three o'clock tomorrow. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. I haven't even finished filming my last video and I'm starting, starting another video. Put some gas in the truck. We have a special mission today. I got the boys, the boys with me. I'm terrible about that. A lot of y'all gave me crap in the comments. I never, I never fill my truck up. I always put 20 or $30 in my truck and that's it. Every day, like I do that. And I'm, I don't know why. I just, if, if I, if I explained it to you, you would understand my logic here, but I just, I refuse. Oh, whoa, what the, <laughs> did you just shoot at me? That hit the camera, it hit my hand. Hold on the camera. Do what? There's nothing in my hands, bro. Hey, you ready for this? Ready for this? Hold on. Wait. You still have those? Yeah. Bro, my shit. Goddamn right. Oh. Yeah, buddy. Starlight's in the The stars in the ceiling. Oh, geez. Hold on, I'm trying to you got, say hat. hello. Hey. Hello. Hello. Look at, look, you got cheeks on here. Yeah, I got Damn. sandy cheeks. I got, I got SpongeBob, Patrick, Mr. Krabs, and cheeks. Sandy cheeks. What about Plankton? The whole gang, the whole gang. Plankton's not on there now. Oh, they ain't a part of that shit. She is. Obviously, we'll film it more when we get to the shop because it's dark right now, but this is it. Oh, it's a 1500. Yeah. I know it was a, it's a Duramax, right? Then I give you the, did I give you the keys? Yeah, I got the keys. I was going to say, I, <laughs> I hope I gave you the keys. No, the 1500. Hell yeah. 2022. Refreshed front end Silverado RST Z71. Obviously, we'll film it more at the shop when it's light outside so you guys can get the full effect. Oh, it's a Duramax, too. Yeah. I think you just said that. I thought you told me it was a Duramax. No, it's 1500. That's that's what's cool about it. We've, we've, here, hit the unlock. Get in for a second. I don't know how to do that. Got you. You click the button on the door the handle button. and it unlocks. If the, if Dude, the I drive 2003. I don't have this fancy. Look at this. Kind of nice. Big screen in it. The, the shifter down here. I mean, it's, the inside is just like the GMCs. Ooh, little wood paneling on the door. All right, all right. Dude, the mocha brown. Mocha brown. Yeah, is that I, what it I is? Didn't, I didn't realize it was brown. Yeah, that's clean. That's cool. Is the screen right here? Give me the key. Bro, maybe uh, taking a nap in the back. I wonder if the screen will come on. Yeah, there we go. I want to go wait. That's a big screen. cool all right chick-fil-a time uh, i wanted to be able to document us picking up the truck so we're doing a, a build on this truck obviously that we'll talk about more when we get to the shop today um, i had to come by and pick up the keys yesterday which i will insert a clip here me during the day on my way home picking up the keys yesterday the beginning of the story i just picked up the keys to the first 2022 silverado that will have a all chrome 12 inch lift 26 by 16 forgiatos and 40s, first in the world. Let's get this bread. As far as I know, there's been one or two lifted Silverados with the new refreshed front end that have been lifted, but not like we're gonna do it. So we're picking up the truck, we gotta take it to the shop, but first, we gotta, we gotta go to Chick-fil-A. We had every intention of going to Chick-fil-A and getting our Chick-fil-A and no, Atlanta traffic wants to be fucking stupid. We've been what? We've been sitting in this spot for like an hour right now, it seems what like. What time? 7.40? Yeah, about right an, hour. an hour. Right at an hour we've been stuck here. There's a, there's a wreck down this way we tried to look look this is this is this is my moment i'm gonna be honest with you guys so this is the one moment where i cops are annoying to me because we 
I'm literally looking at the median to where we could turn around and go back through Stockbridge, but uh, they're not letting us go through for, for whatever reason. You can uh, see how we're how we're stopped up here, right? And we got our cops over here in our median, and they're not letting us go through the median. Look at the traffic. We can't turn around. But I know that 75 is backed up. We've been dead stopped for an hour. And uh, right, let's see what happens. Oh, he's not gonna let him go through either. He won't let anybody turn around anymore. He won't let anybody, let anybody turn around right there. We're 20 feet from it, he won't, won't let anybody turn around. But I know that if traffic has been stopped like this for an hour, that means that it's got to be backed up all the way to Atlanta at this point. Because 75 is one of the busiest interstates in the southeast. Being stopped like this, dead stop for an hour, means that traffic is going to be bad for probably two days. Yeah, I mean, man, you can't even jump in the woods and piss. Yeah, you can go piss, but I can't go in the woods. I've had to poop all morning. I even said it at the beginning of, the vi of your video. i got to poop. Can't go poop. Right when we got the truck at the dealership. Right? Stuck hour in traffic. Yeah, that's an hour and a half ago. Still got to poop, but we're out here just hanging out, you know what I mean? Do, doing our thing. Hey, but while we're waiting, you want to take a look at this uh, brand new Silverado that we're picking up? Brand new 2022 Silverado. Hey. Yeah, you ever done you ever done a truck review in the middle of the interstate? No, I've before? not. Before, <laughs> you want to do one today? I've been stopped in the middle of the interstate. With... You've been stopped in the middle of the interstate the with them with, with, with the there. floats. <laughs> idiots out here. All right, look, 2022 Silverado with the refreshed front end, all gloss black. We got the black bow tie, got the black tow hooks. I love so so watching this go down the road. I love the headlights. Well, I love the headlights. It drives and say, it's smooth. It's got the 20s on it. Got the, the Z71 badges. So for the most part, the outside of the truck is the same as the 19 to 21s anyway. But I'm yes, impressed. It does have the Duramax. Duramax. I'm impressed. The, hey, the Duramax will get up and go. Oh yeah, it will. It'll get up yeah. and go. This truck is virtually the same as the 2019 to 21 Silverados. Uh, the only difference obviously is the refreshed front end. And then what I was showing you guys earlier, the inside is a lot different. Um, it doesn't look as brown as it did at the dealership. But we got the uh, got the bows inside. We got the all black leather. Super nice, super nice black leather. Uh, something that's really different about uh, these trucks is it's got the shifter on the console instead of the shifter on the uh, the column here, which I'm not a fan of, to be 100% honest. I hate that the shifter is in the console, but you know, obviously not my truck not my problem it's part of the reason why i chose to get you know i would rather have a 14 with a key instead of the fob i don't like the fobs either i'm a key kind of guy i like to have a key i don't like to have the fob i want to turn a key when i get into a truck but ultimately i feel like you know everything's the newer wise is, is leaning more towards this joe blow cops still chilling over there won't let anybody I know those guys are just having a good old time. What are they talking about right now, you think? Big, nice screen on the inside. Normally, and I said this about the GMC, the GMCs, or my body style, like, you know, everything newer than this, has a more vertical layout, right? All your buttons kind of conform with the console. These trucks have a more horizontal layout. All the buttons are horizontal. All the gauges are horizontal. The big screen's horizontal. It kind of favors the Cadillac as, you know, it, it kind of wraps into the dash as one big piece. The Cadillacs, I believe have one big screen the only uh, if I'm if I remember correctly the Silverados and the GMC's um, have a cutoff here on the screen but obviously all digital screen you do have your your heads up display that I don't think is turned on right now um, and then your big horizontal it's like a 19 or 21 inch screen or whatever the hell it is I don't know what it is okay. K camp on that thing gotta be gotta be what, what we listen to perfect time how you like your new truck it makes me want to sell them on an upgrade. We're all selling them, getting new trucks. We'll update you guys in a little bit. Still stuck in traffic, you know? Nothing nothing fun going on out here. What 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 kind of games can we play? I gotta poop. What kind of games can we play? How many how many tires can I piss on in the next hour? <laughs> it blows my mind that this guy's not letting us turn around right here. Dude, he let no sh it, probably that's, that's 50 the, cars turn around. That's the only reason that we came down here is because we thought we were going to be able to turn around and we're not. I hopped we, out of the truck, had people move forward just to get your happy yeah. ass there. Yeah. Freaking these cheese, cheese balls, balls over here. I hope they watch the channel. Hold on, let me focus on these guys. They're not even looking. 
Look at these guys over here. Tom and Jerry over here. And why to a lay with it? And why to a lay with it? I like getting money, I got time to get it. Target on me, so my car's a tenny. Dancing with the devil, I don't bargain with it. Bobbing in the dash, and the stick is with it. And I hit the four or five on the wet side. But I'm from the east side, this how we slide. This how we ride, yeah, yeah, this how we ride. This is stupid. We left my house at what, 545, 550? Right it's around eight, there. It's 8 o'clock, 8.07. Two hours and we're still sitting here. We've been here for about an hour and a half, roughly. I just saw a guy get out, walk his dog. People are about there just chatting, hanging out. Really? This is some like LA type that you see on the internet. Dude, I want Chick fil A. That's, that's all we wanted this morning was some Chick fil A. It's all we wanted. I'll take McDonald's also. No, no, I want, no, I want Chick fil A. We can't get, get Chick fil A tomorrow. We got to get it today. Uh, Y'all know we got to have the Chick fil A. We got to. My well, boss knows I'm late for work. I'm never late unless this happens. Always the first one there. We're getting Chick-fil-A. The, the part that's stressing me out about this is we were supposed to go get this truck this morning and we were supposed to start building this truck today. So the longer that we're not at the shop, the longer it takes to get started on this truck. This truck's getting a 12-inch chrome FTS lift, 26 by 16s, and 40-inch Nitto tires. This is gonna be the biggest new body style refreshed Silverado on the face of the earth in the next two or three days, right? As far as, I mean, I know it's the, I know there's been lift kits on them, but as far as I know, this is the first one. This is the first one getting a 12-inch lift, 40s and 26, 16. It just, it is what it is at this point. These trucks ain't been out but a couple of months, right? The longer I'm not at the shop with this truck, the longer it takes us to start, the more antsy customers get. You know how this goes. This is a big problem. This is a problem. I'm, I was supposed to be there so they could start on this truck at 8 o'clock. But cops won't let us turn around. Somebody's being stupid up there in traffic and we're stuck now. You know, but you know, all jokes aside, if somebody's hurt, you know, prayers out to, to whatever's happening up there. It's you know, part, part of part of driving up and down, driving up and down 75 every day. But this is this is becoming a problem because I need to get this truck to work. So. Story of my life. I wasn't able to get it on video, but the reason that this cop car is blocking the edge right there is there was a white Honda Accord that went through the median right there and almost got stuck down in that in that dip and almost got stuck so that's why the cop is sitting over there now what? Well, we're literally this close and we can't move i'm annoyed how does that work oh yeah Ooh, buddy fancy look we got the bubble good oh uh, yeah, you can be riding down the interstate and just ride that thing. Some, some GTA Woo! stuff. Some GTA sh got all the fancy stuff now. Now this is a lot. Does it go back down? Okay. Look, the factory bed liner? Alright, alright. Kinda like that Chevy. That's a little big Chevy logo back there. Sliding glass window. Oh, how does this work? Yeah, we should. Oh, okay. Yeah, right, yeah. Probably shouldn't. <laughs> Yeah that, yeah, that one goes up, and then right. Yeah. Ooh. There you go. Ooh. There we go. That's it's expensive, huh? RST. Tail lights look the same. Everything about this truck's the same except the interior and the front end, I believe. I like this gloss black though. Super clean, straight from the dealer. No rust. Clean Carfax. I hope not. I would hope so. You guys may have seen uh you got hey turn down turn down so you guys may have heard a little bit of that maybe not well you wouldn't have heard it because the drone doesn't have any audio i went to go fly the drone um one apparently it's a federal law that you're not allowed to fly above an interstate which i was unaware of um 
can't say I've done that before. Um, Only a Mason. No, nah, I've never done that before. Um, two, the, they're investigating the wreck down in front of us, and they already have a drone flying. The sheriff department or the TP, it's not, one of the sheriff or police have a drone in the air already. So I would be interfering with them. Also federal uh, offense. And his third point is it's too windy, I'll lose control. So. He's cool. He was just trying not to. They're they're cool. We we're making a lot of jokes, but they're they're cool guys. Thankfully, I just I don't want to get in trouble. So maybe not my smartest idea, but it was worth a shot. You're right. It was worth a shot though. I got a little footage. Send it right. We can just throw the camera off. Yeah, just throw the camera in there. Yeah. No, you're not ghost driving. Why not? All right, look. So the cop's going back for his car now. I don't know if that means we're moving. That look, means we're about no, to slide. yeah. Look, they're moving the cones. They're moving the cones, baby. Let's go. Yeah. Ryan was starting to lose it. He was over here listening to Pirates of the Caribbean music. It's a cold world. It's a cold world. <laughs> they're moving the cones, baby. Let's go. Look, the wreck had to have been right here because they just opened up traffic and there's nothing ahead of us. So the wreck had to have been up here. So I don't know, but I don't see a wreck anywhere. I don't know where the... It, maybe, uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. That makes no sense to me. Look, we're getting rollers. Finally, finally headed to the shop. No Chick-fil-A today. Stupid. <laughs> When I, when I first heard Jake talking on the phone with this, this customer about, because we, we can hear each other's conversation at the desk up there. First time, speaking of the phone ringing, first time I heard them talking about it, I thought he was crazy. I didn't, I didn't think they were gonna actually go through with an all chrome lift kit. So when they did, it's one of those, you don't even, you don't, you don't think it's real. And then when it shows up and you got a big 12 inch chrome FTS cross member with the compression struts and the traction bars, it's, you, know, you don't even want to touch it. You don't want to mess it up, nothing. But to see it on the truck with the Forgiatos, I thought it was going to be too much chrome. But at the, uh, at the end of it, obviously, you guys have seen the truck. It, it, it really did turn out good.